Hey Dad. Can we go to Disneyland this weekend? No, Classic Caillou. We're not going to Disneyland this weekend. But I really want to go to Disneyland this weekend. So, please take us to Disneyland. I said no, Classic Caillou. I'm not taking you, or anyone, to Disneyland this weekend, because I am going to the Palatagon Library to get some books for my research project. So, stop asking right now, or I'm taking you to Palatagon Library with me. No. Wah! I want to go to Disneyland. 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 Dad, let's go to Disneyland this weekend. Shut up! Classic Caillou, are you deaf or something? I said no. We're not going to Disneyland this weekend, because I am going to Palatagon Library to get some books for my research project. Now, you either shut your dirty stinky jerky mouth up, and stop crying like a newborn baby, or I'm taking you to Palatagon Library with me. So, what's it gonna be? No 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 no. I hate you! Why do you have to be such a dickhead all the time? What the hell is a Palatagon Library? Why can't you just take us to freaking Disneyland? Classic Caillou. How dare you use such a bad word to me? How many times have I warned you against using a bad word? Do you want to get grounded or something? That's it, I'm taking you to Palatagon Library with me, whether you like it or not. So you better get ready young man, because you can kiss your lovely PS5, goodbye for the weekend. All you're going to do, is read, read and read again, through the weekend. The next day. Classic Caillou. We're now on our way to Plotagon Library. Can I tell you something? What? Plotagon Library, is one of the largest public library there is. And that means, there are plenty different kinds of books available to choose. So, I'm sure, You'll find something you like. Whatever. I don't care. Now. Let's play some music while we drive to Palatagon Library. Oh my god. What a boring, boring song. This is so boring. I'm going to fall asleep any minute now. I'm gonna change it now. Oh yeah. This is what I'm talking about. Wow! This is so much fun! I love it! Classic! Gale! Lou, you've started misbehaving again, just like you did yesterday! How dare you change my music without my permission? This is my freaking car, and I'm going to play whatever I freaking want! So, don't you ever, change my music, in my car, without my permission to do so! Now, do you get it? Or do I need to slap it into your freaking head again? We're now at Palatagon Library, Classic Caillou. I'm going to tell you the rules of the library now. The rules are, no talking loud or yelling, return books to their proper places after use, listen to the librarian if the librarian talks to you, and finally, be respectful to others. You have to obey these rules or you could get kicked out, or even banned from the library. Am I clear? Oh. Whatever. Hello Mr. Anderson, it's so nice to see you again. Hello Mrs. Williams, it's good to see you as well. I'll like to look around the library, and maybe borrow some books. But I'm also here with my 10 year old son, Classic Caillou. He'll need a library card, as well. Alright Mr. Anderson. You got it. Thank you Mrs. Williams. Classic Caillou. There are lots of books in here, as you can well see. 
Feel free to look around, I'm sure, you'll like some books in here. Okay. Classic Caillou. Have you found some books you'll like in here? No, Plotagon Library sucks. These are boring boring books about planet, technology, buses, cooking, and other dumb boring topics. I hate it here. Common Classic Caillou. I warned you about raising your voice in the library. Do you want to get kicked out or something? There are other books besides planet, technology, buses, and cooking. There are comic books, cartoon books, the ABCs, Barney and others. So, you just need to go around, and quietly find something that catches your interest. I freaking hate Barney and friends, and I hate reading books anyway. I don't know why you brought me to this stupid library, when I could just be at home playing my video games or something. I really 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 freaking 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 hate it here. There's nothing fun about Plotagon Library. Is everything okay Mr. Anderson? You and your son seems to be arguing and making lots of noise in here. This is against the rules of the library, as you're disturbing the peace and quiet of this library. I'm gonna ask you to tone it down, or I might have to kick you out or something. I apologize Mrs. Williams, we're very sorry. There will be no more noises, I promise. Classic Caillou Do you hear that? No more noises. Now, go find something to read. If you look very well, you'd find something you like. Whatever. Later. Hey! Give me that Berenstain Bears book, right now. That title looks interesting. I wanna read it. Well, I got it first. There are a lot of other Berenstain Bears books available. You should get those instead. No! That's the one I want. That title looks interesting, and I want to read it, so give it to me now. Now you're just being annoying, and if you don't go away, I'll report you to the library staff. Give me the book right now, before I beat you up. You dare not do that. Later. Mr. Boris Anderson, your son, Classic Caillou, beat up someone in the library, and now, that boy, has bandages all over his head. I knew from the moment I heard you two arguing and making stupid noises, that you were trouble. That's it. Your son, Classic Caillou, has been banned, for two years, and, I'm also banning you for three months. Now, the police are on their way to arrest your son for assault. Oh. My. Freaking 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 freaking, God. Your son, Classic Caillou was just in here the other day, and now, he's back? I'm so sick and tired of you both, and all your troubles. Did you see what your son did, beating up, and assaulting another person? That's it. Your son has been a constant nuisance and trouble to this community, and, I'm locking him up, in jail, until Halloween. And, you are required to pay the sum of $20,000 as compensation to the boy's family. Hey Dad! Can we go to Burger King? I'm so hungry hungry. No, Classic Caillou, we're not going to Burger King tonight, because we're having chicken salad for dinner tonight. No, I hate chicken salad. They're so disgusting. I want Burger King for dinner tonight, so let's go to Burger King. Classic Caillou, didn't you hear what I said? I said we're not going to Burger King for dinner tonight because we're having chicken salad, and that's good and healthy for your body, so stop this misbehavior right about now. No! Why do you have to be so mean all the time? I want Burger King 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 I want Burger King. So, let's go to Burger King for dinner tonight. 
classic Caillou, how dare you talk to me in such manner? Have you totally lost your manners, young man? Or are you deaf or something? I said no. We're not going to Burger King tonight, because like I already mentioned, we're having chicken salad for dinner tonight, which is good and healthy for your body. So, shut your stinky little jerky mouth right about now, or, I'll be sure to shut it for you. Hey honey, I'm afraid we wouldn't be having chicken salad for dinner tonight. Because, the salad aren't good anymore, and they're now rotten. So, you can take, Caillou, classic Caillou, and Rosie to Burger King for dinner tonight, and then, we can have chicken salad for dinner tomorrow night. Classic Caillou. Did you just hear that? Looks like we wouldn't be having chicken salad for dinner tonight after all. You mom said the salad are not good anymore, and they're now rotten. So, I'll be taking you, Caillou, and Rosie to Burger King for dinner tonight. Yes! I'm super excited. We can finally go to Burger King for dinner tonight. This is going to be so much fun. Hello, sir. Welcome to Burger King. How may I serve you? Thank you. I'd like to have the Sword to Chicken Club, with large French fries and a medium sweet tea. All right, you got it. And I would like to have a sword du king, with large french fries, and a large Dr. Pepper. Okay, you got it. Rosie would like a King Jr. meal with chicken nuggets, small french fries, and an apple juice. Alright, coming right up. And I would like a King Jr. meal, with a cheeseburger, small french fries, a chocolate milk, an Oreo chocolate milkshake, and a Hershey's Sunday pie. Hold on classic Caillou, let me stop you right there. We're not going to get you a Hershey's Sunday pie, an Oreo chocolate milkshake, or any desserts by Burger King tonight. What? You've got to be kidding me. I said I want my Hershey's Sunday pie, and Oreo chocolate milkshake, with my King Jr. meal. So, give me my Oreo chocolate milkshake, and my Hershey's Sunday pie, with my King Jr. meal right now. Classic Caillou. Did you not hear me well the first time? Are you deaf or something? I said, we're not getting you an Oreo chocolate milkshake, a Hershey's Sunday pie, or any desserts by Burger King tonight. There are some little Debbie oatmeal cream pies, Pulseberry chocolate chip cookies, Betty Crocker fudge brownies, Hostess Ding Dong, Dora the Explorer fruit snacks, and Dryer's ice cream at home, so shut your stinky little mouth, and stop this misbehavior right this second. No! The Little Debbie Oatmeal Cream Pies, Pulseberry Chocolate Chip Cookies, Betty Crocker Fudge Brownies, Hostess Ding Dong, Dora the Explorer Fruit Snacks, and Dryer's Ice Cream at Home, Smells Like Caillou Stinky Socks. So, get me my Oreo Chocolate Milkshake, and Hershey's Sunday Pie, with my King Jr. Meal right now, or I'm gonna destroy this place. Classic Caillou. How dare you talk about Caillou socks like that? Don't you know he always washes his socks now every day? That's it, I've heard enough of your stupid misbehavior and childish temper tantrum. We're going home, and, since you won't listen to me, you can kiss Burger King goodbye for tonight, because you're not getting anything. No 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 Are you kidding me? Not you and your little spoiled brat of a son in my office again. Are you the only ones in this country? First, your son destroyed properties at McDonald's worth thousands of dollars, and now, he repeats it again at Burger King? I'm so sick and tired of you and your spoiled little son. Anyway, you already know what to do now, that's another $20,000 in bail. I'm afraid that at this point, you're gonna go bankrupt pretty soon. Now, get the hell out of my office. Dad. Why am I still in jail? What am I still doing in here? Shut up! Do you know how many times I have spent money bailing your stubborn little bum from this place? You think I'll keep tolerating your stupid misbehavior by bailing you out of here all the time? 
Are you planning to bankrupt me already? I don't care. You can stay in here for as long as you freaking want. That's what you get for always jerking around, and misbehaving all the freaking time. At least you wouldn't be misbehaving in my house now. Hey honey, I'll be making dinner soon, but I realized we don't have vegetables anymore. Could you please get me some at Walmart? Sure. Anything else you need? No. That's it for now. Okay. I'll go grab my keys, and I'll be back, in no time at all. Five minutes later. Dad. Where are you going? I'm going to Walmart to get some vegetables, for dinner tonight. Do you wanna come? No way. I don't want vegetables, I want to go to McDonald's for dinner instead. No, classic Caillou. Eating McDonald's all the time is unhealthy for you. Instead, you should eat more vegetables, so you can grow healthy and strong. No, I don't want to eat vegetables. I hate vegetables and salad. I want to go to McDonald's because I love McDonald's. Classic Caillou, I said no. You have to eat vegetables first, because if you eat unhealthy junk food all the time, you'll get sick and you'll die. Now, if you're not coming, get out of my way, I got to go. Later. Hey dad, can you get me The Sims 4 for my PlayStation? No, classic Caillou. We're not here to buy games for your PlayStation, I thought I made it real clear, before leaving home, that we're here to buy some vegetables for dinner tonight. But I really want to buy The Sims 4 for my PlayStation, I've been wanting to buy it, and now that I see it at Walmart, you're going to get it for me now. Classic Caillou, did you not hear me the first time? Have you gone deaf or something? Don't you see how much that game cost? Like I already said, I'm not buying you The Sims 4, because we're here to get some vegetables for dinner tonight. Besides, you already have the Spider-Man, Miles Morales, I got for you with your PS5, and I'm not buying you any more games for now. So, stop with this misbehavior, right about now. No, I already finished playing the Spider-Man, Miles Morales you got for me with my PS5, and now, I want to play The Sims 4, so, stop being a stingy jerk, and get me The Sims 4 right now. Classic Caillou, how dare you talk to me in such manner? Do you want to be grounded for 2000 years? I said no, I'm not buying you The Sims 4, so you are better shut your stinky stinky mouth right about now or go earn some money, and buy The Sims 4 by yourself. I want The Sims 4 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 I want The Sims 4. Excuse me sir, is everything okay over there? It looks like you and your son are starting to cause a scene in here. I'm so sorry ma'am. Everything is fine. Classic Caillou, can you see that? You're starting to cause a scene in here with your childish temper tantrum. So you better shut your smelly stinky mouth and stay quiet while I buy some vegetables and don't get us kicked out. Later. What? No 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 no. Mr. Boris Anderson. At this point, I've lost count of how many freaking times, you and your jerky little spoiled brat, classic Caillou, has been to my office. I am so mad, sick, and tired of your freaking troubles. First, your son crashed the car into a private property, then, causes a freaking false alarm, then, beat up an innocent boy in the library, then, destroyed McDonald's and Burger King and keeps misbehaving in every damn place all the freaking damn time. And now, your jerky jerky son has destroyed Walmart again. That's it, 
I'm sending him to a maximum security prison to lock him up for 5628139473615275843617915826439172568431 years later 82514973681429378615 Hey honey, what's for dinner tonight? We're having spaghetti meatballs for dinner tonight, just the way you like it. That sounds nice, I can't wait. Yeah, I'm going to head over to the kitchen now. Later. Hey dad. Can we go to Wendy's for dinner tonight? No, classic Caillou, because we're having spaghetti and meatballs for dinner. But I really want to go to Wendy's for dinner tonight. I said no classic Caillou because we're having spaghetti and meatballs for dinner tonight, and you're still grounded grounded for misbehaving at Walmart, Burger King, and McDonald's. So no, I'm not taking you to Wendy's. No, I want Wendy's, 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 not disgusting spaghetti and meatballs. So, let's go to Wendy's right now. Shut up, classic Caillou, have you suddenly gone deaf or something? Did you not hear me the first time? I said we're not going to Wendy's, because we're having spaghetti and meatballs for dinner tonight, and that's final. So, shut your stinky smelly poopy mouth, before I ground you for 2000 years. I hate you! Why do you have to be such a stingy jerk? You're the most stinky jerky jerky father ever. Classic Caillou, how dare you talk to me like that? You better watch your tongue with me, young man, or I'm really going to be grounding you for 2,000 years. And the answer is still no. We're not going to Wendy's for dinner tonight, so you either eat spaghetti and meatballs, or shut your poopy poopy mouth. Hey Dad, Mom said we don't have spaghetti, to make spaghetti and meatballs tonight, and, Mom said you can take me, Caillou, and Classic Caillou to Wendy's for dinner tonight. Classic Caillou, did you hear that? Looks like we're going to be going to Wendy's, for dinner tonight after all. So, get in the car and let's go. Yes! Finally, we can go to Wendy's for dinner tonight, I'm so excited. Later. Hello, and welcome to Wendy's, how may I serve you today? Thank you. I would like to have a chicken pretzel bacon pub, with a side of chili, a large Coke Zero, and an oatmeal bar. Okay. Coming right up. Rosie would like to have a kid's four-piece chicken nuggets with a side of chips, a chocolate chunk biscuit, and a small milk. All right, Rosie, you got it. And they would like to have a kid's cheeseburger with a side of chips, a medium high sea fruit punch, and a chocolate frosty. I'm so sorry to say this, but I'm afraid we are already out of chocolate frosties. What? What? Please tell me you're joking. How the hell can you be out of chocolate frosties? Can't you get new ones? I'm so sorry, but we really are out of chocolate frosties, but you can get a vanilla frosty instead. No, that's not what I want. I hate vanilla frosty, and I want a chocolate frosty instead, so, get me my chocolate frosty right now. I'm afraid it won't be possible, because we're not going to be having chocolate frosties until tomorrow. So, unless you order something else, there's really nothing I can do. Classic Caillou, you heard the lady. They're officially out of chocolate frosties, so, stop being a spoiled brat and a bad kid, and order something else like a vanilla frosty. No, there is no way I'm taking a vanilla frosty. I want what I want. I said I want my kids cheeseburger and chips, with a chocolate frosty, and a medium icy fruit punch. So, I want my chocolate frosty, because I hate vanilla frosty so so much. Classic Caillou, that's it, I'm not taking your stupid misbehavior again, so, stop acting like a freaking three year old, and take a vanilla frosty, or you get nothing at all. I want chocolate frosty I want chocolate frosty I want chocolate frosty I want chocolate frosty I want chocolate frosty. Give me my chocolate frosty now, or I'm going to poop my pants so Wendy's will smell like my stinky poopy poop. You would do no such thing, classic Caillou. Oh 
Oh my god, what's that terrible smell? Daddy, why does this place smell so bad? Yeah, this is such a terrible smell. I think that boy with a gray shirt over there just pooped his pant. We better start leaving now. What? Sir, I'm going to have to respectfully ask you and your son to leave now, because his misbehavior is driving all our customers away, so, please leave. Classic Caillou, can you see what you've done? That's it, we're leaving, and you're in big big trouble young man. Later. No 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 no. Classic Caillou, you already know what time it is. You have misbehaved again today, and instead of just taking vanilla frosty since they're out of chocolate frosties at Wendy's, you refused, and started throwing your stupid little temper tantrum once again. You pooped your stinky smelly little pants so that Wendy's started smelling like your stinky pants, and drove all the customers away. You're my worst worst son ever, you keep misbehaving, and embarrassing me in every public place. First, you misbehaved at McDonald's, and then you misbehaved at Burger King, and just the other day, you also misbehaved at Walmart, and now, you've also misbehaved at Wendy's again. That's it, I'm taking your PlayStation, your tablet, your phone, and your desktop computer away, you're going to be doing Caillou and Rosie's laundry for the next three weeks, and just forget about visiting Leo anytime soon, because you're so grounded grounded till Halloween. Caillou and Rosie. Are you ready for school today? Yes, Dad. Ready as I'll ever be. Sounds good, Caillou. What about you, Rosie? Rosie's very happy to go to school in Dad's car. Sounds good, Rosie. I hope you've taken your lunchbox. Yes, Mom made us delicious spaghetti and meatballs for lunch in school today. Oh, nice. I guess it's time for us to get going now. Wait a minute. What about classic Caillou? Meanwhile... Oh my gosh! That hurts so bad! Shut up! Instead of you to get up early, and prepare for school today. You're right here, playing dumb video games again. Do you want to walk to school today? Oh no. Please don't make me walk. My legs will hurt so bad. Then get your poopy poopy pants in the car now. You have one minute to brush your smelly stinky mouth, pack your bags, and your lunchbox, or else we're leaving and you're walking to school today. One minute? That's too small. Shut up! Your time starts now. Later. Okay class. It's time for your lunch now, so take out your lunch and eat quietly. Hey Leo, what are you having for lunch today? I've got spaghetti and meatballs. That's nice Caillou. I've got some chicken tenders and potato wedges from KFC. Oh, nice. Let's eat now. Yeah. Before that, I'll use the restroom and I'll eat when I get back. Oh, me too. Let's go and we'll eat when we get back. Oh, shoot. I can't believe I forgot my lunchbox. It's because my stupid dad rushed me. And I'm so so very hungry. But what am I going to do now? Haha! -ha, I have a brilliant idea. I'm going to steal Leo's lunch, since he and Caillou went to the toilet. I'll steal Leo's chicken tenders and potato wedges from KFC, before they get back. Five minutes later. Oh no. Caillou, I can't find my chicken tenders and potato wedges from KFC. I think someone must have stolen it. What? Who could it be? I'll go report to Miss Faye now, so we can find who took your chicken tenders and potato wedges from KFC. Okay. Miss Faye, someone stole Leo's chicken tenders and potato wedges from KFC, and now Leo has nothing to eat for lunch. What? Who stole Leo's chicken tenders and potato wedges from KFC? Someone better talk right now, or I'm reporting you all to the principal. It was classic Caillou, 
He took Leo's lunch when Leo and Caillou went to the restroom. What? Classic. Gail. Lou, what is this I hear of you stealing Leo's chicken tenders and potato wedges from KFC? I'm so sorry. I forgot my lunchbox, so I decided to steal Leo's lunch and eat it, because I was so hungry. Classic Caillou, just because you forgot your lunchbox doesn't make it cool for you to steal Leo's lunch. Get your poopy pants to the principal's office right now. Classic. Gail. Lou, you have started misbehaving once again. What makes you think you could steal Leo's lunch and get away with it? That's it. Just wait until your dad hears about this. Oh no no. Please don't tell my dad. He'll ground me again. I don't care. You deserve to be grounded for all of your misbehaviors anyway. No 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 not again. Classic. Gale. Lou, you were busy playing video games, instead of preparing for school in the morning, and you forgot your lunchbox, because you weren't prepared for school. But you gave me only one minute, to brush my teeth, pack my bag, and my lunch. Or I'll have to walk to school, and my legs will hurt so bad. Shut up! If you had prepared like Rosie, and Caillou, you wouldn't have forgotten your lunch, you idiot. That's it, you know, you're staying grounded 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 till Halloween end. I'm taking your PlayStation away this time as well. Alright class. So today, I'm going to be asking you all, what you want to become in the future. So, let's start with Rosie. Rosie, tell us what you want to become in the future. Yes, Miss Faye. Rosie wants to become a pilot, so she can fly people all around the world. Oh that's so nice Rosie, I'm very impressed with what you want to become in the future. So, keep studying very well, and one day, you'll become a pilot Rosie. Alright. Next, let's ask Caillou. Caillou, what would you like to become in the future? Yes, Miss Faye. I want to become a doctor in the future, so I can save people from dying. That's very sweet Caillou, I'm very impressed with what you want to become in the future as well. Like Rosie, keep studying very well, and you'll become a doctor one day. Alright. Now, let's ask Classic Caillou, Classic Caillou, what would you like to become in the future? What? Uh, me? Yes, you. Classic Caillou, I thought I just called your name. So, tell us what you want to become in the future right now. Okay. What do I want to do in future? Haha, <laughs> I know it now. Yes, Miss Faye. I'd like to become a banker, so I can take all the money in the bank, and buy whatever I want. What? Classic. Gail. Lou? Don't you know, that is stealing? Just because you're a banker, in a bank, doesn't mean you can take other people's money. Do you want to go to jail or something? Classic Caillou, that is the dumbest answer in the world. Next. We're going to ask Bethany. Bethany, tell us what you want to become in the future. Yes, Miss Faye. I like to become a racing driver because I love cars, and I want to compete in Formula One. Oh, that sounds nice Bethany. Who knows? Maybe one day, you'll be like Lewis Hamilton. Um, I see Bethany loves cars. Yes! Finally! I know how to get her, to like me. I'm gonna ask Dad, to buy me a car. Later. Dad, can you buy me a car? Because, if you buy me a car, I can drive around, and I wouldn't have to only play dumb video games all day. <laughs> Classic Caillou, are you sure you're okay? Because you sound, like you just lost your mind, or something. What do you mean I should buy you a car? Why are you laughing at me? All I asked is for you to buy me my own car so I won't play dumb video games all day, 
or drive to school in your car every morning. Shut up! Don't you know how expensive cars are? Do you think buying a car is cheap? And even if it wasn't, you're only 10 years old, what could you possibly need a car for? What does it matter? People drive cars all around every day, so why can't I have my own car? Buy me a car, 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 buy me a car. Shut up! Shut the hell up, classic Caillou. Don't you know it's against the law for you to drive a car at this age? Do you see any of your classmates driving a freaking car? I don't freaking freaking care about any stupid law. All I want is my car, and you're going to buy me one, right now. No, classic Caillou, I am never, ever, buying you a car. Even when you turn 18, because you're a stubborn kid who likes to jerk around all the freaking time. I hate you! Why do you always have to be such a stingy stingy jerky jerk? You're the worst dad in the entire freaking world. How many times have I told you to watch your language with me? Do you want to get grounded for 2000 years? And the answer is still no. I'm never, ever, buying you a car, so if you want one, go buy it for yourself. The next day. Oh, shoot. I left my glasses in the car, and now, I can't see clearly. Classic Caillou. Can you go get me my glasses? My keys are on the drawer in the room. Sure. I'll be right back. Now, I'm gonna steal Dad's car, and run away so he'll never find me. Yes! Finally. This is gonna be so much fun. Wow. This car is so fast. I'm so excited. I can't wait to show it to Bethany. Wait a minute. What's that ahead? Oh my gosh! Later. What in the freaking world is wrong with your son? Driving around and destroying other people's property, worth thousands of dollars. Well, I hope you like spending money, because... You're gonna be paying thousands of dollars in damages. No 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 classic Gale Lou you have misbehaved again like you always do But this time around you took things way too far I clearly told you that as a 10 year old you know nothing about driving and shouldn't drive but what do you do You steal my brand new car worth thousands of dollars and crash it into people's private property And now I have to pay thousands of dollars, for damages. You're my worst child ever. All you ever do is misbehave, and jerk around all freaking day. You already know what time it is. You're permanently grounded grounded, never to be ungrounded, ever again, you stupid jerk. Two thousand years later. Hey Boris. It's been two thousand years now, and we are now dead and in heaven. Don't you think you should unground Classic Caillou now, so he doesn't stay grounded forever on Earth? No, I'm never, ever, ungrounding him no matter what. He can stay grounded on Earth, forever, for all I care. Hey Dad, it's the weekend, so, can we go to KFC for dinner tonight? No, classic Caillou, don't even think about it, because it's not happening. But I'm hungry, and I want to go to KFC for dinner tonight, so, let's go to KFC for dinner tonight. I said no, classic Caillou, that is never happening again, no matter what. Even when we run out of food supply, I'll just drive to the grocery, and buy new ones. So don't even think about it. I want KFC, 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 I want KFC. So, let's go to KFC for dinner tonight. No, classic Caillou, stop acting like you've suddenly gone deaf or something. You heard me very well the first time, that is never, ever, ever, 
happening again? Because you've misbehaved at McDonald's, Burger King, Walmart, and got us kicked out of Wendy's recently. So, just forget about it, because nothing you do or say is changing that. We're not going to KFC, and that's final final. I don't care, because I really really want KFC, and I'm not gonna stop until I freaking freaking get it. So, let's go to KFC right about now. Classic. Gale. Lou, you had better stop acting like a freaking spoiled brat, and stop getting on my nerves. You're going to shut your smelly stinky jerky poopy poopy mouth right about now, or, I'm taking your PlayStation, your phone, your iPad, your desktop computer, and you'll never get any more allowance, or pocket money, ever again, and I'll still ground you for 2000 years. So, shut up. And go to your room right now, before I change my mind about this. But I really want KFC, and my stupid dad won't get it for me. So, what am I gonna do now? Brain Blast. I know exactly what to do. I'm gonna sneak into dad's room, and steal some of dad's money, so I can buy KFC. This is gonna be so good. Later. Haha, <laughs> now, I'm gonna find where dad keeps his money so I can steal some, and go to KFC. Finally, I'm so excited. The next day. Now that I've stolen dad's money, I'm going to head over to KFC now. Hello, and welcome to KFC. What can I get you? I would like a kid's meal with popcorn chicken, a side of tater tots, and chocolate milk. Sure, coming right up. Wow, I can't believe how incredibly easy this was. I might have to start doing this every day now. Classic Caillou, I recently noticed some of my money is missing, when I checked my safe today. That means, someone has been stealing my money. And wait a minute. When did you get this fat? What have you been eating? I have been eating too many KFC dad. When I asked you to take us to KFC, and you refused, I started stealing your money to eat KFC every day. And now, I've gotten really fat, from eating too many KFC. What? No 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 classic Gail Lou why do you always have to be such a jerky jerk misbehaving all the freaking time I made myself very clear that I'm not going to buy you KFC because you misbehaved at McDonald's Burger King Walmart and you got us kicked out of Wendy's And what do you do You steal my freaking money that I had saved up and kept in my little safe all to get this fat, and ugly? That's it young man, I'm gonna do what I should have done already. I'm taking your PlayStation, so you won't play dumb video games all day, and I'm taking your phone, your iPad, your desktop computer, and I'm cutting off your allowance, and pocket money. And, you're definitely getting grounded big time, until you learn to stop misbehaving and jerking around all the freaking freaking time. Alright class, today is report card day, and I'm going to be handing out your report cards. So, you must take it home to have it signed by your parents, and bring them back to me tomorrow. But before I do that, I want to call out some of the best results, and the worst result in class. So, with the best result in class, let's give a round of applause to Caillou. 
Yes! I'm so excited. Caillou. I'm very happy with you, for studying very well, and getting A's in all of your classes. I hope you'll keep studying and doing very well. And now, to the second best result in class, let's give a round of applause to Rosie. Rosie. I'm very happy with you as well, for studying and getting A's in almost all subjects, like your brother Caillou. So, keep studying and doing very well as well. And now, for the worst result in class. Let's give a very very big boo for Classic Caillou. Classic Gail Lou, you're my worst student ever. Instead of studying and paying attention in class, all you ever do is misbehave and jerk around all the freaking time. And now, you got F in all of your classes. I hope your dad sees your report card and grounds you permanently, because that's what you freaking freaking deserve. Oh no. I'm gonna be so grounded grounded, when I show my report card to dad. And what if he takes my PS5, or my iPad, or my phone, away again? I'll be so bored, because I can't play video games, and I'll be grounded grounded. But what am I gonna do now? Brain Blast I know exactly what to do. I'm gonna make a fake report card, and change all of my grades to an A. And then, I'm gonna show my fake report card to Dad. That way, I won't be grounded, and I get to keep my PS5. I am such a genius. Later. Hey Classic Caillou, where's your report card? I've seen Rosie and Caillou's report card, but I haven't seen yours. So, stop that game right about now, and show me your report card, immediately. Yes Dad. This is my report card. Wow. Classic Caillou, I am very, very happy with you. I can't believe how well, you've done in all of your classes. You must have studied very well. You are now ungrounded, and, we can go to McDonald's, Burger King, or Wendy's, whenever you like. I am so so proud of you for studying, and doing well in all of your classes. Thanks dad. I told you, I'm a genius. The next day. Alright class. It's time for you to submit your report cards, with your parents signature. So, bring your report card to my desk, one by one. Five minutes later. Classic. Gail. Lou, what's this signature on your report card? Clearly this is not your dad's signature, and, it's not the same signature on Caillou and Rosie's report card. So, explain yourself, right about now. I'm so sorry. Because I got the worst report card in class and I did not pass any of my classes, I was so scared that my dad, would ground me. So, I faked my report card. What? That's it, classic Caillou. You were going to the principal's office, right about now. No 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 no. Classic Caillou, you're such a freaking nuisance, to my school. You prank your teachers all the time, pull the freaking fire alarm, and now. You fake your own report card? That's it. You're getting detention for the next two weeks, and just wait until your dad finds out about this. Oh my gosh! That hurts so bad. Shut up! What in the freaking 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 world is wrong with you? How dare you lie to me, and fake your own report card? I'm so sorry. I did not want to get grounded again, so I faked my report card. Shut up! Did you really think I wouldn't get to know about it? Instead of you to study, and pay attention in school. You misbehave, jerk around, 
and play dumb video games all day. That's it. You already know what time it is. I'm grounding you for the next 1000 days. And... I'm taking away your PS5, because you're not allowed to play any more video games, until you get your freaking grades up. Hey Dad! The new iPhone 14 is out now. Can you buy it for me? No, Classic Caillou. I can't buy you the new iPhone 14 because, it's very expensive, and there's absolutely nothing wrong, with your iPhone 8. But I want the iPhone 14 because it's new. So, buy me the iPhone 14 today. I said no Classic Caillou. I'm not buying you the iPhone 14, because there's nothing wrong with your iPhone 8, and it's a super expensive phone. So, you either use your iPhone 8 or nothing at all. But I really really hate my stupid iPhone 8 because it's so so old, and the screen is starting to crack. So, buy me the iPhone 14 because it's a better phone. Classic Caillou, are you deaf or something? Did you not hear me the first time? I said no. I'm not buying you the iPhone 14. If there's anything wrong with your iPhone 8, then we can just repair it, instead of spending a lot of money buying the iPhone 14. You're just 10 years old, and your iPhone 8 is perfect for you. I hate you! Why do you have to be so stingy all the freaking time? You're the worst dad ever. Some of my mates in school already used the iPhone 14, so why can't you just buy me the iPhone 14? I don't want to use some stupid old iPhone 8, so, buy me the iPhone 14 right about now. Classic. Gail. Lou, how many times have I warned you, never to talk to me in such manner? Why do you keep misbehaving like a freaking spoiled brat? Do you want to get a punishment day or something? I've made it very very clear, that I'm never buying you the iPhone 14, because it's a super super expensive phone, and you absolutely have no need for it. So, you either use your iPhone 8, or buy the iPhone 14 yourself, and nothing you say will ever change that. Now, go to your room right this moment, if you don't want to get grounded big time. What's so special about buying an iPhone 14? And now, because my stingy dad won't buy me the new iPhone, I have to use the stupid jerky jerky iPhone 8. But I really want the iPhone 14. So, what am I going to do now? Haha! -ha! I know exactly what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna steal dad's money, since I know where he keeps his safe, and then, I'm gonna buy the new iPhone 14, so I won't have to use my jerky iPhone 8 anymore. This is such a brilliant idea. I'm such a freaking genius. Now, let's bring out the freaking safe and take some money. I can't wait to have my iPhone 14. Later. Hello there, welcome to Apple. My name is Beth, how may I help you today? Hello, my name is Classic Caillou, and I'd like to buy the new iPhone 14 today. Okay Classic Caillou. How would you like to pay for this? I have all the money, right here with me. So, just give me the iPhone 14. Okay. But before we do that, what about your parents? Only your parents or guardian can help you with the paperwork. What nonsense are you talking about? I have all the money right here with me, so give me my iPhone 14 right about now. I'm sorry Classic Caillou, but unless you're above the age of 18, we need your parents or guardian for the paperwork. Classic Caillou, some of my money is missing again. Do you know anything about this? I'm so sorry. I stole some of your money again, because I wanted to buy the iPhone 14. What? No 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 no. Classic. Gale. Lou, what is your freaking freaking problem? 
I told you very clearly, that I am never, ever buying you the iPhone 14, because there's absolutely nothing wrong with your iPhone 8, and it's a freaking expensive phone. But what do you do? Instead of just using your iPhone 8, or repairing the cracked screen, you sneaked into my room, and stole my money once again. You're in big big super mega duper big trouble young man, because I am taking your PS5, your iPad, your desktop computer, and, you get no phone at all, because I am taking your iPhone 8 away as well. And that's not all. Because I am grounding you for the next 100 days. Hey honey. I'm sorry we won't be having spaghetti and meatballs for dinner tonight. I just realized we don't have any spaghetti left. So I was thinking, why don't you go to Diary Queen with Caillou, Classic Caillou, and Rosie for dinner tonight? Oh that sucks. I really wanted spaghetti and meatballs, but you're right. We'll just go to Diary Queen, me and the kids. Alright. I hope you have a good time with the kids. Hey Classic Caillou. We won't be having spaghetti and meatballs for dinner tonight, because we're out of spaghetti. But I'll be taking you. Caillou, and Rosie to Diary Queen for dinner tonight. Diary Queen? What's Diary Queen? It is a restaurant, that is ice cream, fries, chicken tenders, etc. Whoops, that sounds like fun. Let's go to Diary Queen. Later. Hello, and welcome to Diary Queen. How may I serve you? Thank you. I would like a crispy chicken sandwich, with large French fries and a large Diet Coke. Coming right up. And I want a kid's meal with chicken tenders, french fries, a milk, and a kid's cone. Sure, you got it. Rosie wants a kid's meal, with a hamburger, french fries, a milk, and a kid's cone. Sure Rosie, you got it. And I want a kid's meal with a hot dog, french fries, a milk, and a frosted animal cookie blizzard. Oh no. Unfortunately, we don't give out blizzards with any kid's meal. What are you talking about? Is this some kind of joke? I'm afraid it isn't. But you can get a kid's cone, just like your siblings. No. I don't want a stupid stupid kid's cone. I want a frosted animal cookie blizzard, and that is final. Classic Caillou, what is this nonsense? You better listen to the lady right about now. No dad. I want what I freaking want. I want a frosted animal cookie blizzard, not some stupid kid's cone. Classic Caillou, did you not hear the lady? You don't get any blizzards with a kid's meal. So, you either get the kid's cone, or you get nothing at all. And you better stop with this misbehavior, right about now, or I'm taking you home right this moment. So, what's it gonna be? Whatever. This sucks. One minute later. Classic Caillou. Now that you got your order, you're gonna eat quietly, like Caillou and Rosie. So, go ahead and finish up. Oh my freaking god. This food tastes like trash. Diary Queen freaking sucks. I want to go to McDonald's, or Wendy's instead. So. Let's leave, and go to McDonald's or Wendy's. Classic Caillou, shut your stinky smelly poopy poopy mouth right about now. Just because you don't get a frosted animal cookie blizzard, with your kid's meal, does not mean Diary Queen sucks. The food tastes great, and you can see Caillou and Rosie enjoying their meal, so no. I'm not taking you to McDonald's or Wendy's or any other restaurants. I want McDonald's, 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 I want McDonald's. Let's go to McDonald's right about now, or I'm gonna freaking poop my pants again, so that Diary Queen smells like my poopy poopy pants. No classic Caillou, you wouldn't get a frosted animal cookie blizzard with a kid's meal at McDonald's, or any other restaurants. So you either stay and eat your food, or you get nothing at all and you wouldn't dare to poop your pants.
five minutes later. Excuse me sir, I'm afraid, I have to ask you to leave, with your son this moment. Your son's misbehavior, is starting to drive all of our customers away. Everywhere smells terrible of your son's poop. I'm so sorry. I apologize for the troubles. Later. No 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 no. Classic. Gale. Lou, you are in big big super mega duper big big trouble young man. I am freaking done with you and your stupid temper tantrums. First, you misbehave at McDonald's, and then, Burger King, poop your pants at Wendy's, and now. You get us kicked out of Diary Queen for the same goddamn reason? That's it. You are grounded grounded for the next 100 days, and you get no TVs, no movies, no video games, no computers, no junk food, and no fun for you for the next 100 days.